Hello Virgo, we're going to be doing your reading for March 2022. Don't forget, I do use two decks and I will be using the Astro Dice. We'll talk about these in a hot second. So if you are new here, hang in, it's going to be a long video. And don't forget to hit like, share, subscribe, comments, and utterances of discontent will be met with love and humor. And I'm a Virgo also, so... Um, I'm always nervous. I'm always like, Ooh, what cards are going to come up? But, uh, don't forget to check also your rising sign and your moon sign. If you don't know where those are, put your birthday in Google and then write moon sign after it. And then put your birthday in Google and write ascending sign, rising sign, anything like that after it. And it'll come up. Okay. Virgo, uh, Virgo. Well, it's not terrible. It's not terrible. It's not terrible. Last month was a money month, you know, so that came through. So that was good. Okay. No, this is getting better. This is getting better. Okay. I'm a Virgo, so I always dread. <laughs> I dread. I'll do all the other signs and then I do Virgo last because I'm like, oh God, what's going to happen? Okay. So let's see here. We have, okay. Work uh, could be better, could be worse. Um, it does look Virgo like the end of January. We decided to, I'm going to say we, we decided to pick up and make a big decision here. Now, here is the thing. There are two trumps here. I have strength card for a foundation magician card for kind of like the head or, or where you're, where our, I'm going to say our, I'm just going to say it. I hate doing it, but I'm just going to say it. Uh, for our uh, mind, which is having two trumps. Trumps are actually stronger cards. So the fact that there's two Trumps here and there's a Trump in the first position, um, there is a lot of deciding the path to go on. Okay. So if you are a Virgo and us Virgos, we know exactly what we're going to do. We know when we're going to do it. We have a list. We vacuumed the night before we set out our outfit. So the fact that there is a lot of like, could go this way, could go this way. Um, there is a little bit of indecision, but only, only because it's, there's too many ways to go. There's so many opportunities here. So Virgo, I'm going to tell us, um, it does say that there is a situation that you may have thought was going to be over, but is continuing. Now this could be a good thing or a bad thing. This could be a debt. This could be a relationship. This could be a job. This could be a health thing. So there's something you thought was going to be over, Okay. But it is going to continue. Now, like I said, that could be like, let's say it's for a job, right? It could be, you thought you're going to lose your job, but it's going to continue. Or it could be, you hate your job, but you got to stay there. So, so you're, you personally there in, in a TV land are going to need to know exactly what I'm talking about. Um, I'm going to tell you 80% of the time people come and talk to me, it is about relationships. So, um, we can just take this as a relationship thing. Maybe there was a relationship you thought was going to be over in the December, January, February time period, but it's going to continue. Okay. Or it could be a relationship problem that you thought was going to be done, but it's going to continue. But your foundation here is strength. And this is this actually one of the Virgo cards of the deck. So your foundation is going to be yourself and your, how you're going to get through the problem is going to be yourself too. That's the magician. The magician is the manifester. So you are going to Virgo, use your brain to get through this situation. It does say the situation's going to be hanging out for a little bit. I would say until April, maybe even May. Okay. And, but it does say you're going to come out of this at the end. You have the high priestess as your final card. So of course, Virgo, you're going to be victorious. Why would you not be? You're a Virgo. That's what you do. So let's check out this, um, modern deck. Now, if you don't like cursing, you don't like swear words, you don't like dirty talk, I'm not the psychic for you. And this uh, deck has some naughty stuff in it. So I'm just going to close my eyes and pick three cards at random. And this is going to say some more modern stuff like, um, you know, it talks about text messaging and yoga and stuff like that. So let's see, Virgo, I want to pick three good cards for me and for you, Virgo. Okay, let's see. Virgo for March. Virgo for March. Okay. Okay. Two pinks and I'm sorry, two, two blues and a pink. You need a good fucking cry. I don't know, Virgo. Are you a crier? I said, you know, I rarely, rarely am I a crier. But if I'm, if I cry, it's, it's, ugh, I get, a, <laughs> I get an ugly cry. Get the ugly cry on. Let that shit go. Your soul will thank you. Okay. Maybe you need to let go of something. It says, drop the fucking ego. I don't have an ego. I'm a Virgo. I'm perfect. Vulnerability is hot as fuck. I don't know about that. Mm, I don't know. I'm not liking this deck as much today. The 
Uh, it's dark and you can't see a fucking thing. Get your head out of your ass pronto. Okay. Okay. Well, the rebel deck is kind of bitchy today. My goodness. It's accurate though. It's accurate. So Virgo, I'm telling you, you're going to man, you are strong and you're going to manifest your way out of this. Now I'm going to use the astro dice. <coughs> Excuse me for one second. Sorry for coughing. I, I left my tea upstairs. Um, if you have not seen the other videos, this is the Astro, this is the kit that you're going to get when you buy the Astro Dice. Um, you have to get the Astro Dice. They're so much fun. So you get Psychic Vision Oil, you get this beautiful uh, bag, and then you get the three dice. And these dice are so much fun. And you get a cheat sheet. And uh, I have a cheat sheet here, uh, off to the side here. So this is what your cheat sheet is going to look like. It's going to have all the information you need on it. So one of these planets is, or one of these dice is going to be your astrological symbols. I have a little string from the bag here. This is going to be your zodiac symbols right here. 12, right? And then the 12 houses of the zodiac. If you've ever seen your zodiac chart, you have a bunch of different houses and they all tell you different parts of your life. And then this is the planets. And it also includes like the sun, the moon, north node, south node, things like that. Okay. So we're going to shake these up and we're going to see what Virgo, what us, us Virgo, us fabulous Virgos need to know for March 2022. Okay, let's see. So we got, hold on, let me go through all this. Uh, sun, that one I know. And we got... What symbols is Taurus in the first house? So the first house is all about your personal identity. It is um, image, self, so who we are. Okay, so this has to do personally with us. All right. Can also be a physical body, can also be an environment. So, so it's a very tangible card, we'll say. So what is Taurus all about? Taurus is also a fixed earth symbol, okay? So Virgo is a mutable earth, but it's a fixed earth, so it's going to be a grounding. So it is more peaceful, sensual, stable. Um, I'm reading off of, I have a whole bunch of cheat sheets here. Let's see, Taurus, stolid, stable, beautiful things, okay? So this could be about beautifying yourself. And the sun is also about identity, and about individuality and setting yourself apart. I will tell you, it's kind of funny this is going on because I've been on a fitness journey recently. So this would, this could be that. This could be you really push forward in your looks, or if you're doing a uh, physical change, if you're, or if you're doing a change to your home, your car, something around you. So this is going to be a beautifying thing going on. Okay. Don't think vanity is bad. I actually I was telling the story. I had a uh, Mr. Craig. Uh, if you ever have readings with me, I'll talk to you about my friend, Mr. Craig. And we had another mutual friend of ours that said that me and Mr. Craig were vain. And Mr. Craig and I just sat there kind of blinking because we were, this person was actually trying to say something bad about us. And we were like, what's wrong with that? <laughs> so we're like, is there, was that a put down? I don't understand. So it's like that. So it's, so there is some kind of beautiful edification, we'll say either of your personal self and your body or uh, uh, could be a self-help, could be like you're growing and learning a new thing and you're trying to become a better person, or it could be your physical environment, your house, your apartment, your condo, your car, something like that, okay? So that was pretty painless, Virgo. I'm not gonna lie to you, I was expecting something terrible, but I'm a Virgo, I'm a warrior, I'm a Mercury, that's what we do. This card gives me hope. You can manifest your way out of anything. And I really, really, really do believe that. Now, if you have hung in for all of this, can you hang in for another minute? Can I have it for like one more minute? Let me tell you something real quick. I released something this week that I haven't had for a while. I now have the upgrade to my product. So very, very, very long ago, I used to have upgrades and it got out of hand. I'm not going to lie to you. So the upgrades... Um, I didn't do them anymore. So if you bought uh, so any of these soaps or uh, oils or candles or anything, um, there was an option to upgrade. Well, I took that away because it, it, people were kind of abusing it. Let's put it that way. It is back. And not only is it back, it is half price. No joke. So anything you buy, like let's say you get one of my beautiful Think of Me oils or you get a Sugar Daddy soap or you get a money product. If you want this to be extra strength, I have an option on the Etsy. Go ahead and click the links down below. It'll take you to my stores and all that stuff. And if you're on something, 
that does not have a link, go ahead and find me M-O-M-A-D-E-L-I-A, or you can text message me at 484-634-0435, and I will get right back to you. Do not call me, text me, and because uh, I usually am on the phone or I'm doing something, so um, I don't answer numbers. I don't know. So if you want to get a hold of me, text me. But if you want any of these products, I have a whole bunch of stuff on Etsy. So you can look for me there and I have the links to everything down below. But let's say you want this product extra super strong. Let's say you got something going on where you're like, you know what, instead of buying 10 of them, I'm going to buy like two extra strong. So for a small upcharge, I can make this extra strong for you. So there you go. Um, anything you want, not the spells. If you want a spell extra strong, you will have to go up to the next level, but any of the products, any of the things, soaps, oils, salts, um, or votives, I can absolutely bump that up for you to the next level. And don't forget when you get there, I can do spell work for you. And also I give the best readings. So if you would like a personalized reading that is just about you, we can sit, we can talk, we can go over anything you want. Go ahead and click those links down below or find me on Etsy or find me on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, all that good stuff. Or you can always text message me at 484-634-0435. So I introduced the uh, Astro Dice kit last week. We got this beautiful kit going on. I have some new oils. This is the Think of Me, mega, mega Think of Me. I got to tell you, this is crazy. This is really good. I'm getting so many good feedbacks about this. And now we have the upgrade and it is back for 50% less than it originally was upgrade your products, upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. It is a, it is that I think it's to me, it's just insurance. It's just such a great thing. And I will massively upgrade your product and send it out to you super, super, super fast. Um, I'm also increasing shipping times, um, incre uh, increasing the number of times I ship because during COVID, it was difficult to ship a lot. So I was shipping once, maybe twice a week. I'm now shipping three times a week. So you will very likely catch one of the shipping days and get the product out to you. So there you go. That's, that's all the housekeeping for today, Virgo. I think we went over everything and I hope you have a beautiful day and a beautiful March and let me know if you need help with anything at all. And I'll take care of that for you.